Six Sigma has been simultaneously called a revolution and nothing new. Indeed, many of the tools in the Six Sigma methodology are the same tools used in a number of other quality initiatives. The difference appears to be in the organization and application of those tools, the limited staffing requirement for its utilization, and its emphasis on specific fixed-length projects. The term sigma comes from the Greek alphabet and is used in formulas to indicate variability. Sigma quality levels indicate how often defects are likely to occur. Higher sigma quality levels indicate processes that are less likely to create defects. For instance, a three sigma quality level is approximately 10,700 defects per million opportunities, while a six sigma quality level is less than 3.4 defects per million. The definition of Six Sigma is not simple. More accurately, Six Sigma has several definitions. One, it is a quality metric that can be used to compare processes. Two, it is a quality system that controls variation in products. Three, it is a philosophy that uses collected and tested data to make decisions. Four, it is an overall quality improvement and business strategy. And finally, Six Sigma is a problem-solving method that identifies root causes and helps determine permanent solutions.